Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's Mercy for the F again. I just posted um, a vlog about but my uh, concluding my fasting. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this video is uh, affectionately titled Don't Be a Hater About My Fasting. Like, seriously. Guys, I've been overweight for many, many, oh, more than a decade. Seriously. And um, the one time I've decided to step away from the table, just for four days, I'm getting all this drama from people, you know, letting me know that fasting is not healthy and all this dramatic bullshit, like seriously? Because I decided to not put any more poison inside of me, and face it guys, <laughs> our food is pure poison, you know this. It's good poison, but it's poison, and we all know this, you know? We've all seen Super Size Me, and we've all said, you know what? I'm not going to eat from McDonald's, I'm not going to eat fast food, I'm not going to do it right, right. You know we don't care. At the end of the day, we don't care. That's why most of us are so unhealthy, you know? But I'm just so, like, annoyed that I'm getting so much drama over me, myself, and I deciding just to step away from the fork. Step away from the plate, like step away, you know, just say, just step away, you know, me not eating, um, me being 242.8 pounds, so you're telling me if I decided not to eat five days, I'm going to starve to death, if I decided not to eat for five days, I'm going to somehow miraculously or, um, instantaneously develop a malnutrition problem or something, guys, get a grip of your damn self. Like, seriously, it's not that serious. It's really not that serious, you know? Uh, how many times have you decided to skip a meal or two and, you know, like, come on, what's the big deal? Except my fasting comes with reason, you know? Despite what you're thinking, that I'm going on fasting to... To lose weight, which is, uh, duh, that's number one, because I'm trying to detox so I could, you know, get my system going and get my own personal program going pertaining to my weight loss, you know, so I'm using it to detox, but the thing is, I don't have to explain to you, you know, everybody I've had this conversation with, you know what I say to you guys, do some research, you know, yes, we know that there are many different types of facts out there, and yeah, I understand, okay. So what's the problem? You know, if you're so educated on what fasting is and what starving yourself is, which how the hell can a 242.8 pound person starve in four days? Can someone tell me that? If anything, all the damn food, all the bad shit I've put in my system over the past decade or so, that's what's been poisoning my body. You know, that's what is for the primary contributor for my hypertension, you know, like seriously. So if you guys are, you know, have your opinion about why it's not good and why this and that, keep it to yourself, you know, like seriously, keep it to yourself because I don't care, you know, I think it's a wonderful thing and I'm encouraging people to try and not even just to try like just look up the benefits of fasting i'm not saying to fast 365 days out of the year i'm not saying to do three consecutive 40 day fast i'm not saying if you so desire to go ahead knock yourself out you know probably you probably will get knocked out because you know it's probably a little excessive but don't you know, like, don't knock the fact that fasting does have awesome benefits to it. You know, anyone that's trying to use fasting to just control their weight just, just for that, 
I'm sure, hopefully you've done your research, you know, but I'm realistic. I know if I lost 20 pounds through fasting for four days, honestly, I'm just going to think, okay, I lost some water weight, you know, I lost water weight, you know, and most deaf, I'm probably going to gain back the water weight or whatever it is, you know, but it's not about just the weight loss, guys, you know, fasting has healing powers. It does. Do your research. My mom is calling me. Anyway, guys, I'll talk to you guys later.